Hi, this is Krishna with another question of trigonometry. This is question number 5th, page number 194, exercise 8.4, question number 5th, 6th part. Says prove that the following identities where the angles involved are acute angles or the expressions are defined. So, under root of 1 plus sin a, con 1 minus sin a is equal to secant a plus tan a. So, when you have any roots given, you can see that you can see that you can see that you can rationalize that. So, on rationalizing, rationalizing the denominator. So, this becomes 1 plus sin a upon 1 minus sin a. If we rationalize this, it will be under root 1 minus sin a. So, here we have 1 plus sin a upon 1 plus sin a. So, now, these two, these root are separately, this is also, 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 this is also. So, this is 1 plus sin a, 1 plus sin a. This will be a plus b whole square. So, 1 plus sin a, under root, this will be square. And root is as it is aega. Common, a minus b, a plus b. So, this will be a square minus b square. Under root. So, 1 plus sin a ka whole square. Jab square whole bracket pe hota hai, so usko root se cancel kar sakte hai. Lekin jase ye hai a square minus b square, is ki square cancel hai sakte hai. Kyunki individual digits ka hai. So, upar wala hai dhanega 1 plus sin a upon a square minus b square under root of 1 minus sin square. 1 ka square is 1, sin a ka square is 1 minus sin square. Ab 1 minus sin square a, i don't think that sin square a plus cos square a is equal to 1. 1 minus sin square is equal to 1. Sin square a is equal to 1. So, now we have to cos square a is equal to 1 minus sin square a. You know, let's say cos square a. So, you can try it out. 1 plus sin a upon 1 minus sin square a cos square a. Again, now we turn to over. Here we have plus minus we will turn to the other side. Cos square a is root, so square root is cancel each other. So, you can say 1 plus sin a upon cos a. So, 1 upon cos a, the cos is both of each other upon sin a by cos a. So, 1 by cos a is secant a. Sin a by cos a is tan a. So, secant a plus tan a. So, when you have any roots, you have a root expression, so generally we have to rationalize it. Rationalize it, you have to make a root cancel. And the square root is always cancel when it is on the whole. Individual terms are square cancel. So, this is 5th question, 6th part. And do watch the next video for the next part of this question. Goodbye.